All right, happening today in Austin, it could be a busy day at the University of Texas. Today is the official move in day to the dorms. And while this is an exciting day for new Longhorns, it'll look a lot different. KV's Tori Larned joins us live at the UT campus and Tori. Some students are already moved in this morning and it is a big deal for them and their parents. I remember I always wanted the target bedspread, the newest target bedspread for, you know, for where I was going to be staying. Oh my gosh, exactly, Yvonne. You know, you either go to Target or Bed Bath & Beyond. If you don't have that Bed Bath & Beyond coupon, you go back to Target because it's cheaper there. But it is a really exciting time for students to move in. And like you said, some of them moved in early. They're already here. But today is the big move-in day for the rest of the students to welcome themselves as a new Longhorn here in Austin. And the university has taken preventative measures and spent thousands of dollars, extended their move-in hours to make it as safe as possible. Now, I did check in with them and they said, as of Wednesday, about 600 students have already moved into the dorms and they expect this week and the remainder of the week because today is welcome to be, what is welcome day to be a lot busier. Staff say move ins have gone smoothly so far. They just want students and parents to remember to keep their masks on social distance and show up at their scheduled move in times. Now across the country, though, other universities already sent students home because of COVID-19 spikes. So to try and prevent this, UT will test every student in the dorms for the coronavirus. And while times are different and move-in events are virtual this year, university leaders encourage students to still participate. It's a great way to get to know UT, your fellow classmates, and it's your official welcome to your life as a UT student. Austin's top doctor says there's no doubt universities will see COVID-19 cases as they reopen and it's important for all students to practice safety measures. UT says their semester is primarily online, so campus will look dramatically different in terms of how many students are physically here on campus. But university leaders also set guidelines for all students, faculty and staff, and if they don't follow them, they could face consequences. Now, a big question people will probably have, what about the college parties? Well, as far as on campus, the university doesn't really have parties. So for all those students living off campus, that is the city's jurisdiction. So if you have any issues or concerns about parties you see going on, they recommend that you call the city's 311 line. Reporting on the University of Texas campus, Tori Larned, KVU News.